morning, Rocky. Good morning, Gun Gun. Here you go. Don't eat on the counter. Come on. play this morning hey you guys good morning today we are starting a flight attendant trip it is a three day trip and it is so stinking early because we have two legs and we end up in a very special place so we are gonna go to dallas and we'll sit there for a little bit and then we head to seattle you guys i haven't been to seattle in a few years and i'm really looking forward to it because down here in miami we're not really like feeling any of the fall vibes it's still really hot and i'm hoping that in seattle well i know in seattle it's gonna be a lot cooler hopefully the leaves will be changing and we'll just have some nice brisk fresh air we get started with the day you guys know how important it is to me to live a healthy lifestyle get and give my body as much nutrition as i can and to continue doing that while i'm on the road so i started incorporating ag1 into my daily routine i take this in the morning before i have anything else so thank you to ag1 for sponsoring today's video i'm sure this product needs no introduction but if you guys haven't heard of it ag1 is a daily foundational nutrient supplement that supports whole body health so when you get your package it has this in here but i kind of just wanted to list off what it has because um there's just so much packed into this one scoop that you'll take i'll show you how you take it but it's a multivitamin multi-mineral prebiotic probiotic green superfood stress adogens functional mushrooms and antioxidants so there's so much packed into this little guy it supports your brain your gut health your immune system which is all things that we need especially if you're living a lifestyle on the go like me okay so i'm going to show you guys how you make it it's honestly so easy and this is one of the reasons why i love this product is because you guys know on the go i can't just be carrying a a bunch of things with me um so you put the soup the greens in here and they recommend that you keep it in your fridge and you take the scooper you fill the mixer up with eight ounces of water drop it in and then i do a dropper of this to mix in with it this is the d3 and k2 let's do two for good measure and then you simply mix it up. I love this product mainly because it gives my body the nutrition that I need in a very simple way. It comes with travel packets, so it's easy for me to take on the go. And it's kind of like a one-stop shop for me. Like, this is all that I need to get the things that I just listed to you. And it tastes good. Like, I don't have any problem with the taste. I don't have to mix any sweeteners or anything in with it. Yeah, like it doesn't taste bad to me at all. I take this first thing in the morning before anything else before I eat and it just kind of sets the tone for my day and I love the benefits that it has. So it's great for your metabolism. It has prebiotics, probiotics. So I find that I'm not being as bloated throughout the day. So stress, mood balance, and then your immune system. It helps with some immune support, which we all need, especially if you're traveling. I feel like that's when you need it most. It's so easy for me to keep in my daily routine because it comes with these packets and I can keep these in my purse. I can keep them in my travel bag and it's just a single dose so all you need is the packet your shaker make sure you have eight ounces of water like something that you can measure it with i personally love love the shaker because it's so easy on the go and it's easy to rinse out so that you're not messing up your important routines while you're on the road i've been recommending this to friends and family especially this time of year when we all want to be our best self be ready for holidays make sure that we're feeling our best looking our best because this will help because there's so many vitamins in here and nutrients it'll help with your skin your hair it just will make you feel good from the inside out if you guys are interested in trying out ag1 all you have to do is go to drinkag1.com slash carrie ann to get started on your order ag1 is going to give my community a free one year supply of the agd3 plus k2 this is the dropper that i put in there five of the ag1 travel packets that i showed you guys with your first purchase so thank you again to ag1 for sponsoring today's video now i need to get ready so that we make it to work on time hey you guys good morning Today we are starting a three day trip. It is super early, it's 5.40 in the morning and 
this is a crazy trip you guys i have not gone to the west coast in a while but we are headed there now we're about to head to dallas and then from dallas we will go to seattle and we're laying over in seattle not a long layover um but that's okay so i'm gonna hop on the employee bus just so that i'm on time i'm gonna pre-order my starbucks i've just been getting a regular pike place with a little bit of oat milk and then I ask I get a grande but I ask for it in a um, venti cup and then I put some premier protein in it and it's so good Welcome to Seattle, you guys. We just made it. This hotel and hotel room are so nice. Let me give you a little room tour and then we can chit chat about the day. Walk in and you have the cooler and the little coffee maker. What's in here? Okay, we don't need that. And then to the left. Wow, this is really nice. A little bit of privacy. Cool. Uh, place to put your luggage and then here's an overview how nice is this and we're right on the water but I don't think you'll be able to see it from here no we did not get a water view but look at how cute this is guys I just got back to my hotel room and we had the best time oh my gosh we the whole crew met up except for one of the flight attendants because she was meeting up with her boyfriend but we had the best time so we had clam chowder and a glass of wine and then we went outside and there was a band playing or a single guy playing and it was right on the water and boats would pull up and it was just so great it was really cold though so they gave us some blankets and then we went back inside ordered some what did we get burrata and truffle fries now we're going to bed so tomorrow is another really long day so we go from seattle to chicago chicago to newark it's a three-day trip i don't normally do these you guys so that is the plan and it's gonna be an early morning I have to wake up at 3 40 in the morning but it's okay because we are on west coast time west coast time and we are accustomed to east coast time so it really won't be that early in the morning but I'm going to shower and get ready for bed and I'll see you guys very early oh the kitties are awake In my palm pilot. My little makeup setup. We got our coffee, good more girls, electrolytes. Good morning, you guys. It is around 4 30 in the morning, and I'm just putting on my shoes, which I showed you guys in one of my more recent videos that I just got, and I'm obsessed with them. Um, Mary Jane, it's just so much easier to walk. But we are headed to Chicago and then to Newark. So I will see you guys maybe when we land in Chicago if we have enough time, but I think we might only have like an hour on the ground. Most of it, I think. They've already done most of it, all the rest of these terminals. Yeah, yeah we used to park on the back side of the gate. Now, now they moved us to the B gates. That's our temporary home. Okay. That's okay. miserable there. Yeah, because last works. night coming in, we got assigned with B5 or something, and then they changed it to 
Oh my gosh, you guys. I just made it to my hotel room. I couldn't even tell you what time it is, to be honest, but I know that we're two hours late. We made it to Newark. The first flight to Seattle was easy peasy. The people were so nice. And then we get to Chicago. It's a quick turn, so we're only on the ground for an hour. We keep the plane and we switch pilots. We board up. Everything's good. Smooth sailing. And then they call maintenance and I have not heard of this before but this is a new reason why a flight can be delayed is because we had maintenance because the first officer's chair was not like it wouldn't lock so it kept moving around and obviously you can't be having that what they have to do is it could take 45 minutes to locate the chair like a new chair replacement one and then once they find the chair it takes an hour to put it in or you get a new plane. So that's, we ended up getting a new chair. So we were on the ground. We actually deplaned um, because we knew that we would be there for about two hours and it would just be more comfortable for everyone. If they were off the plane, they could use the restrooms, they could get food, drinks, all that. So we deplaned. It got fixed, I'd say two hours, hour and a half. And then meanwhile, I finished Love is Blind. Oh my gosh, so good. And then we boarded up easy hour and a half flight here made it to newark the new airport renovations are so great i used to avoid this layover because it was really needed to be updated but it's beautiful highly recommend checking it out and now we are here in this hotel we have a very short overnight i want to say it's probably like 10 hours um so i'm going to finish editing a video and i'm going to go to bed I'm so tired, like sitting and I don't know, just coming from Seattle to here, then the delay, I'm done. I'm so ready to be home. And thankfully tomorrow is one leg home to Miami and we land in Miami by 11.20 and I'm off for a few days. Good morning, you guys. Good morning. Hi. So, it's 6.40 in the morning. My van's in five minutes. And it is go home day, and I tell you guys I'm so ready to be home. I was pretty much sleeping with one eye open last night. I just cannot seem to stay asleep. I don't know what the deal is, but it was just a drastic change from hotels from where we were yesterday to where we are today. The one yesterday was much, much nicer, so... <laughs> I'm ready to be in my bed. We have one leg to Miami. We're done. I lost my dry shampoo. <gasps> what am I going to do? Um, so I will see you guys when we land. Okay, so we just landed back in Miami. It is 12 o'clock noon. And we had one flight here from Newark. We grabbed, again, if you guys haven't been to Newark, the airport is so, so nice. We grabbed some great breakfast. I'll insert a picture here. Me and this other flight attendant both wanted to try two of the sandwiches it was like a lox new york bagel and the other one was more of like a bacon egg and cheese but on french toast yes it was very good so we both bought one and then we shared it in half and that is the best thing to do i always want to try everything just share it then it's like best of both worlds and then we walked on the plane and our sweet captain got us all breakfast sandwiches from duncan so now i have this left over um it's so nice when the pilots you know take care of you because a lot of times when we get to the airport we don't actually have time to grab food um so that was very very thoughtful but i'm going to end the vlog here you guys i am so happy to be home i hope you guys enjoyed this three-day trip with me all the trips next month are three-day trips as well so better vlogs better layovers more things to do and i will see you guys in our next video have a great day